Good morning hockey family, Etienne from Field Hockey Education. In today's coaching video, we're going to have a nice little attacking drill. In this drill, we're going to work on first time shots, slaps, uh, leading and passing as well. So it's an all round good attacking little drill that you can use with your players. You'll also see in this video, drill loud, how it works and the purpose of this drill. So I hope you enjoy this video and let's go. If you have not subscribed yet, please click that little icon in the bottom corner. Please like this video because it shows the support towards my channel. Thank you for all the support so far in this channel. I really do appreciate it and enjoy the next video. So with this attacking drill, player one is going to start with the balls. There's going to be the coach or assistant coach or if you have a, a extra teacher or whoever can um, stand over there with also a pile of balls. Because what's going to happen is now is player one is going to pass the ball to this cones over here. Player two then needs to go around as quick as they can to try and get in front of the cones because the cones implements a defender player two is going to receive it while this is happening player three over here is going to make different leads to try and get in front of this defender player two is going to receive it and make a hat pass to this side where player three is just going to run onto the ball receive it and then go to the circle take a slapstick shot towards the goal the keeper saves it, the keeper saves it, as soon as that's done player 3 will keep on with their run and then they will make a run over here with peace bodies and the coach or assistant coach will throw an extra ball in and then they will do the one time shot into the goal or against the keeper purpose of this drill is the players will learn how to lead in front of the defender to get the ball first. They will learn how to make different leads, the zigzag or a little snake type of lead to lose defenders so that they can have more space and more time when they actually receive the ball from their player. They will learn to make passes in front of the player so that the player that's receiving the ball can actually just keep going with their pace and not stop and then get the ball to go forward and trying to score. So they will learn how to just pass the ball in front so they can just keep going with their pace so they can get to the circle as quick as they can. They will learn how to use the slap as a hitting method and not just trying to hit as um, every ball that they get to get into the circle. So they can just use the slap Try and get it for post or try and get it on the keeper so it can rebound and then you can go for a one-time shot. Um, and talking about the one-time shot is it will teach the players to back up as soon as someone took a shot and they're backing up. If it comes off the keeper, they can have a nice little one-time shot so they don't have to stop the ball and then go because in that little area where the one-time shot is possible, there's a lot of players in that little area. So there's not going to be time for the ball to stop and then um, put it in the goal. So one-time shot's going to help them to just get used to just taking a one-time shot. So that was the attacking drill. I hope that uh, all the coaches have learned something from this nice little attacking drill that you can use with your players as soon as we are able to coach again. Uh, thanks for watching this video. I really do appreciate it. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.